What's up guys? It's a new week in Fortnite Battle Royale and you guys know what that means. So we have got some new challenges. I'm back again this week to help you guys get these challenges as easy as possible and to honestly this is a pretty light week, I'm not gonna lie. This is definitely gonna be a very short video, but uh, I do have a couple of uh, couple of good tips here for you guys. So uh, let's take a look at the challenges here. First up, deal damage with SMGs to opponents. Can't help you out there, you just gotta pick up a sub and do some damage. Search chests in Dusty Divot. There are chests in the watchtowers, chests in the various buildings, even a chest up here near the old Dusty Depot warehouse. So just land here a lot, eventually you're gonna get it. It's really not that hard. Sometimes what I do for these open certain chest challenges is I'll just wait till the next week. A lot of people don't know that, but you can wait until week six to complete this because not as many people are gonna be landing here. But honestly, I like landing Dusty Divot, so it's up to you. Next up, we've got use a vending machine. This one, again, can't really help you out with, you know, just go find a white vending machine somewhere, get 100 wood, put it into it, and boom, you're done with your challenge. So that's, that's not too bad. You gotta do it three times. Next up, we've got dance with others to raise the disco ball near Loot Lake. So if you guys don't know, there was a new Easter egg added into the game with yesterday's update, and uh, there's kind of like this dance hall in the Loot Lake factory that has four different dance pads on it. And when all four dance pads are being danced on at the same time, it's gonna raise a disco ball up and makes like a cool effect and stuff like that but really the biggest tip I have for you guys on this one is do it now do it as soon as you possibly can the longer you wait to do it the more difficult it's gonna be now if you have a full squad you can run with then this doesn't really apply to you because you could do this at any point but uh, if you're trying to do this solo or maybe with like two or even three people you want to do it as soon as possible because everybody's gonna be trying to get this today and maybe a little bit tomorrow as well the problem is is you need the cooperation of other people and when you think about online games especially like Fortnite competitive games stuff like that it, uh, it doesn't always happen that way. A lot of people like to troll. A lot of people are going to be picking up weapons and going in there trying to shoot people, trying to stop them from getting the, the challenge and stuff like that. So really, I would try to do it as soon as possible when people are actually trying to get the challenge because after today and maybe a little bit of tomorrow, a lot of people are going to have the challenge and it's going to be more people trying to troll than tr people trying to get the challenge. So just try to do it as soon as possible and I promise you guys, you'll be fine. You'll be able to get it. Just uh, knock it out early. Now, next up, follow the treasure map found in Greasy Grove. Here's the treasure map right here. This was by far the easiest treasure map we have ever had. It's the evil Omega base in the side of the mountain, just on like the little nose staircase type thing. So go over there right next to Stabby, land right on top of the staircase, boom pick up the battle star and you've got that one complete. Finally, the last two are minigun or light machine gun eliminations. Again, that's pretty self-explanatory. Channel your inner ninja to get those LMG kills. And uh, finally, last but not least, eliminate opponents in lucky landing. So lucky landing is going to be a bit of a hot spot this week and uh, I'm excited. It should be a uh, it should be a fun week. So yeah, like I said, Pretty self-explanatory, really easy challenges here. I mean, five of these seven, you're gonna be getting just by playing normally. I feel like I don't think you really have to go out of your way to complete them. The other two are a little bit more difficult, and like I said, the biggest thing is just to make sure you do that disco ball Easter egg way before it gets too old and everybody's already done it. So try to do it today if you can, if not tomorrow. So there you guys have it. Quick little cheat sheet for the week five challenges here in Fortnite. Thank you guys so much for watching. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed it. This helped you out and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.